Hello everybody and welcome to today's video. Um, as you probably know, I've been gone for quite a while. And um, I've been gone for around two weeks. And the reason for that is I had been uploading quite rapidly and um, I wanted some time off. Um, but, don't worry, I've been working on some stuff while I was gone. And that contains Fallout 76 stuff. As you can see right now, I'm in Fallout 76, and um, I have been working on a character that, as you can see here, is right now level 91. Uh, it's the top one, as you can see. It's level 91. And um, in today's video, I'm going to show you how I got it to level 91 in around two weeks. And um, I'm also going to show you how I got an insane amount of ammo while I got the XP. So as you can see here, I have... 11,332 50 cal or 50 rounds um, so I'm gonna show you in today's video the route that I have made on the map um, of where I go to get both asset steel XP and lead ore so uh, yeah let's get right into it so first I want to talk about uh, perk cards because um there is a perk card that I would say is it's not necessary but it's very nice when you're doing that and that is travel agent and the reason for it to be that good is as you can see here you pay 30% fewer caps when fast traveling and we're going to be fast traveling a lot so yeah let's get right into the route and um, I'm just gonna show you some clips on uh, where this route is and I'm gonna show it all off to you guys and you can do it yourself so let's get right into it. First location that I go to is the White Springs Golf Club. And I'm guessing a lot of you guys already know about this location. This is basically a very nice XP location. Now I'm just very quickly going to show off. Um, you can enter here and you will see that once you get in, I suddenly get very low frame rates. Oh, all right, nice. Uh, you will see there's just a bunch of ghouls here and you can kill them a bunch of XP and um, yeah that is basically the first location it's just a little XP location and it's very useful for a lot of XP and I just died great let's get right on to the next location alright so the next location is actually the Charleston Capitol building and once you spawn in you just want to follow the route that I take go over this little wood bridge and you can go around the corner here Now once you're around the corner, you will see um, this door here. Now you just want to go in here. Alright, once you're in, you will see this little place here. And uh, you will see a terminal over here. So you just want to go on this DMV number terminal. Now once you're here, what you're going to do is you're going to go and you're going to boot up the department B. So once you've done that, you can exit and there will be a little voice and you can see they will spawn in all of these schools and you can also farm these for XP as you can see here I'm just gonna kill these guys off and yeah you're gonna need a lot of ammo so make sure you have ammo um, but you can also head in and you can head through these doors here and you will see some more ghouls and you can just ra run through this entire building and there will be a whole bunch of ghouls and you can see I'm getting 266 XP per ghoul I kill and uh, yeah you're just gonna run through all of these ghouls and get a bunch of XP as you can see here I will show you a bit of um, of this here but you can skip it um, if you don't want to see it uh, but yeah that's basically it you want to go into the Charleston building so let's just get right on to the next location alright so the next location is of course the lucky hole mine we're gonna be able to get a whole bunch of lead from this now what I would uh, do is I would recommend you to get the excavator armor for this because it's going to make you get four times the uh, or I think it's four times uh, the you know the w when you mine and have the uh, excavator power armor on you're basically going to get more ore so that's that's basically it um, it's very nice and I can make a tutorial on that if you want that 
go down and like the video and subscribe because uh, that will motivate me and I will make more videos. So let's get right into it and let's enter the lucky hole mine. All right, once you're in here, I'm not gonna make a full full guide on uh, on this, but okay, that was a legendary. Once you're in here, uh, you can go through the mine and you will find a bunch of lead ore. Make sure you check the corners and uh, yeah, you'll get a whole bunch of lead ore. Uh, and you can come out with, I think it's about 452 lead ore. So, uh, yeah, let's get right on to the next location. Alright, so the next location is, of course, the flooded train yard. And um, here, we're going to have a bunch of snallygasters. Now, uh, they will give acid, and uh, that is very useful for smelting our lead ore. So, if we just go around here, you will be able to find some snallygasters. Oh yeah, we got one over here. Um, my record of finding snallygasters is about 8 snallygasters at this location, I believe. So, I don't know if you can find any more, but um, I think so. The max that these, uh, the, the max amount of acid that these guys can drop is 8. So, yeah, watch out for that. As you can see here, we get, right here, there's one, we get six waste acid and where's the other one you can see here on the other one we got six waste acid so that's very nice that's 12 waste acid for both for just only two and you can see we got another one here so yeah let's get right on to the next location all right so the next location is harper's ferry and here we're gonna find a bunch of steel scrap from uh, super mutants so i'm gonna show you um uh when you get in you can just uh go out here and if you get on up on this street here you will find a church up there with a bunch of super mutants you can just see the tip of it uh, right up there uh you will also be able to find some here but um there will also there will either spawn super mutants or scorch or a mix uh of them so you can both find super mutants scorched and ghouls um, so if we just go here, if we can see if I got the Scorch spawn or the Super Mutant spawn. So if we just go up here, there we go, there's a Scorch. So as you can see here, they're very easy to kill and they can get you a bunch of um, guns which you can pick up and then scrap them. Now I'd recommend you uh, having the Scrapper perk. As you can see here, uh, if we just go in we got the scrapper perk down here you want to put that on while you scrap the weapons so yeah make sure to do that uh, and i some all right yeah there we go so just run around grab their weapons as you can see here we got a short combat rifle so you just want to grab that and um you can run the through this entire thing i'm not going to make a straight guide on harvest ferry if you want me to do that please like the video because i can do that um so uh, once you have uh, gotten all of this, you can um, you can head up to the church, which I'll show you in a second where it is. So the church is basically up there. Once you get up there, there will be some super mutants where you will uh, where you but there will be a workbench where you can scrap all of these weapons. As you can see, I'm already over encumbered. Now I recommend you using the excavator armor again for just this because you will get a hundred extra. Um, carry capacities so that's very useful uh, when carrying all of these weapons so let's just take all these turrets and I'm just gonna cut to some up to the church here as you can see here we up in the church and there is some scorch now you can get either scorch or super mutants as I said right before but uh, you're pretty lucky if you get scorched because um they're not that hard to kill and super mutants is way harder so yeah let's just grab these guys stuff and once you're in here in the church, you can go over to your left side and you will see a weapons workbench and an armor workbench. And here you can just scrap all of the weapons that you got. And there we go, I just forgot to put on the scrapper perk. But um, just make sure you have that on when you scrap all of these weapons. And we can go to scrap and we can start scrapping them. So, let's go right on to the next location. Oh yeah, and just a little quick... um little mention here when you're over here at Harper's Ferry and if you're still over encumbered while you are um, uh, after you scrapped all your stuff as you can see I'm still over encumbered then you can head up to the Berkeley Springs station because there will be a stash box there 
um, I just wanted to say that because, um, that's very useful. And, uh, yeah, let's just get to the next location now. Now, once you're here at, uh, oh, yeah, I'm just going to show the location. Now, uh, this location is actually Tanagra Town. Here, you will also be able to get around 30 to 40 acid. You just want to head up uh, this big tree here. It's it's very cool, I have to say. I really like it. But I'm um, just head up here. And, um, yeah, it's not that complicated. So, uh, I'm just going to cut to uh, till I'm up there. Alright, so as you can see, I'm here now. Uh, once we hit in, we will be able to find a bunch of uh, crickets here, which you can just shoot and kill. And they will all have a nice amount of acid on them. So I'm just gonna kill all of these. And if we just go here, oh, there's another one right there. So let's just kill this dude too. And if we go in here, uh, we can go down and you can see there is a bunch of nice acid right here which we can just grab and uh, once you've taken those out here you can head up these little tunnels here and there will be more of them so yeah that is basically Tanakra Town make sure you loot the entire tree uh, just or just this cave but um yeah you'll be able to get a whole lot of um of acid so yeah Let's just get right next to the next location. Alright, so the next location is pretty much just an honorable mention. And that is the West Tech Research Center. Because here there will be a bunch of super mutants that you can kill for loads of XP. But it's, pretty, it's a pretty high level area and I would not recommend you going here below level 50 unless you have very good weapons and a very good suit of power armor uh, or anything else I mean it's just it's very dangerous um, but I would definitely recommend going here okay so the next location is Green County Lodge uh, you just head in the front door and you will find find um, a bunch of uh, lead there um, I'll just show the sh sh sorry I'll just show a little uh, clip of me taking the lead in there. Alright, so once you're here at Green County Lodge, what you want to do is you just want to head down here. There will be a couple of enemies, but they shouldn't be that hard. Then you want to turn to your left, and you will see there's also a little enemy there. You'll find a whole bunch of um, uh, 160 lib, and as you can see here, 80 lib, and a bunch of stuff, a bunch of these um, uh, dumbbells, which you can find. And, uh, yeah, they give a lot of lead. I think it's 80 lead in just this singular room. There's also one there. Very nice. So, yeah. Let's get on to the next honorable location. Or, wait, what? The next honorable mention of a location. Yeah. Alright, so the next next location is, of course, Blackwater Mine. Now, um, this is a very important location. If you want steel, you can just head in and over here over this fence here I can't even get over the fence nice um you can go and you'll find a bunch of these mole miners and they will all have weapons and which you can scrap and I think my game just crashed no alright so I'm just okay great did my game just crash? okay I don't know what's going on right now okay I, I think we're good alright uh, but you can just kill these guys and uh yeah there's you you can pick up their weapons and as you can see here, they got a bunch of uh, junk. Also, this guy didn't have have any weapons, but you can see there's some short double barrel shotguns, and uh, you can head right over here and you can scrap them. Uh, and what you can also do is you can also head into the mine, and there will be more of them. Uh, I don't think I need to make the video any longer, so I won't show that. Uh, but you can go in there and you can grab that stuff as well. But just grab all of their stuff and go scrap it. So, yeah. And that is the video for today, guys. Thank you very much for watching. It was a little bit of a longer guide today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. If you enjoy my content, please like and subscribe. That would motivate me to make more. And um, dislike if you didn't like it. Like if you like it. Thank you very much. And uh, goodbye.